never in my wildest dream did I ever think that woman would ever be a part of the NRL. For this to come to fruition is massive for the game. So Laura, how did you get into rugby league? Started off at primary school, not official rugby league, but we used to pretty much pick a team and pretend that one team was Queensland, the other was New South Wales. So what team were you? Always Queensland. Queensland, yep, 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 yep Queensland. Yep. <laughs> I was just too rough and like netball and basketball, I was always getting fouled off. My parents just knew they needed to put me somewhere where I could release everything. <laughs> played my first game with the boys and they were awesome but then the college uh, contacted our school, the opposing yep. team and said oh look she can't play because she's a girl. Now I see that so many girls who are in under sixes can, can c continue to play yeah. whereas we didn't have that yeah. you know, for any of the codes so that's awesome with what's happening for women in league now. Yeah me. Never in my wildest dreams did I ever think that women would ever be a part of the NRL. I've been playing for 18 years now, so for this to come to fruition is massive for the game. It's pretty tough being parents and, and playing the game we love. Yeah, especially women. Yeah, you know, yeah. We're both still working while we're, we're playing, so. Yeah, it yeah. takes a lot of commitment. You can just imagine all these young girls watching us on the big screen, and then hopefully they're just gonna wanna be there. I know running out on that day, I know I'm gonna be crying. <laughs> but just so, so honoured and proud to be a part of the first ever competition. It's going to be huge for young girls everywhere, so I'm really excited um, to take you on. <laughs> <laughs>